MLB The Show's coverage of Major League Baseball brings us to the great state of Florida and Marlins Park in Miami. Tonight, it's the first of four between the Washington Nationals and the Miami Marlins. A moment now to take a look at the visiting Washington. Steve Leading off Cook Marlins. will get his first chance Fair at it now. Man. Didn't factor Steve. much into the win yesterday as he took an 0 for 4 in the ball game. Well, it seems like it's going from bad to worse. He had a bad day yesterday, and he's hitting under 200 in his last ball 10. Ball one, no strike. And he'll look at a first pitch curveball that's in the dirt. It's ball one. Eric, these Nationals, as they enter play here tonight, well, they've been on a pretty good roll of late, winners of seven of their last eight ball games. And on top of that, they've already spotted their starter an early lead in this one, so... There's a swing and a drive, and everybody's just going to sit back and watch that one fly. A no-doubt home run. A solo shot here to left. And with it, the Marlins are back even now at one and one. And about the only silver lining to this one from a defensive standpoint is the fact that it came with the bases empty leading off an inning. So you can survive it when this guy's hitting just solo shots. It's when he's doing his damage with two or three guys on base that things can really get out of hand in a hurry. At the plate, Damian Cisneros. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Hey, all right, here we go now. Little dribbler down the line. Throw to first oh. in plenty of time, and his side is retired. One left for Washington. On to the bottom of the fourth, tied 1-1. Come on, kid, get on for it. Digging in to try it again, Steve Third. Cook. He went deep in his Steve first at-bat. We'll Cook. see what he's got in store for us here. Well, I think he proved that he can turn on a pretty good fastball and hit it out of the ballpark, so you need a different approach in this at-bat. And he got him out in front oh, that one. time. Strike one. Boy, we're well into this ball game now, and he's thrown 70% first pitch strikes to all the hitters hey, he's faced. And when you can get ahead, your results are going to turn out well. And it's quickly 0-2. And the wind up and the 0-2 pitch. Fought off at the plate, and we'll do it again. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. Oh, that one deflects off him. I think it got his arm. For the first, he's but he's safe. And now the stadium's attention turns back to the man on the mound. How about it? He's, how's he doing after that shot? Uh, and this Marshall. has to be a big concern oh, here. This ball came back and got him right in the pitching arm. And that is something you just never want to see. You can see him trying to work this one off. And from all appearances, I think. Marcelo Zuna will dig in. He singled his first time around. Deliver the 0 and 1. Runners on the move for second. Pitches a cold strike. The throw. And no throw as he'll just hang on to it. One run, four hits. And no errors in the game for the Marlins. See it drive it. See it drive it. Nope. Slider, ooh, thought he had him, but it's one and two. He took second fairly easily. Any thought of third base here? I, I don't think so. You've got a good hitter at the Literally plate. Right a single is probably all he needs. I'd let him try to drive you in. There's a swing and a high pop-up. Lopez is there for it, and he makes the catch for the second out. JT Real Muto will dig in. 0 for 1 here in this one. Hey, I need you right here one time. 
Smoked on the ground up the middle. And that's through into center field. Base hit. And now he has some trouble with it in center. The run scores from second. It's now a two to one ball game. That's all about picking up your teammate there. Up next the guy moment. before him pops up and second can't get the run home. So Jim he's up there saying, hey, don't worry. I got it. He knocks in the two out. Steve Cook will stand in here hoping to duplicate what he did back in the second inning. As we flash you back to take another look at his solo home run that helped get this offense rolling. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. Swing here on the fastball, and this will get fouled off to the right side. We're in the sixth inning now of a four to two ball game. Rip it up there. Set up away with the changeup, but it's one and one. Hey, get the pitch up there. Let's go, kid. Here's the one and one delivery. Hard liner towards short. Leaps high as he makes the catch. Well done. Oh, you know this ball had base hit there. all over it. Marcel. And for as hard as it was hit, oh, it sure may on. have even made it into the alley. But that's a nice job at short to get all the way up there and just pull this thing down. Brian Dozier will stand in now in what could be a real make or break situation. And you think at this point you have to get something out of this inning. The further you get into that bullpen, the tougher it's going to be to claw back from this deficit. Hey, best stuff right here. Put him away. Left side. Oh, he makes the first in time oh what a play they call it the hot corner for a reason and, and this is a beauty to take us to break more to come from marlins park right after this First for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. Now back, center fielder, Jason. Tightly contested ball game here, so it makes it hard to find our tops player of the game, but I think this fellow right here would seem to be the logical choice. Yeah, he came through with a couple of hits, but more importantly, that big home run, which really led his guys to this victory. So that's a wrap here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Eric Karros and Steve Lyons, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've Here been watching MLB The Show. Tonight. And for First more, click on over to theshownation.com. The Marlins, the Marlins win it 4-2. No to they left Good night from Miami. Miami. For the Nationals, two runs, 10 hits, no errors. They left 15 runners on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and 48 minutes. A reminder that Marlins shuttle buses are available outside Marlins Park with service to the Comer Metro Rail Station.